A very good evening to everyone. It gives me immense joy to welcome our chief speaker for today, Dr. Kavita Gadekar, respected principal sir, Dr. Harish Dubey, all my esteemed colleagues and my dear students. We would start our program with our college prayer. Prabhu Anand Tata Gyan Ham Ko Dijiye Shigra Sare A happy, confident, energetic, strong, and healthy are all the qualities that an individual wants. A well-balanced and a healthy lifestyle can help in achieving the above. The purpose of today's lecture, Balancing Lifestyle for the Youth, is to put more light on the same topic. For this, I would like to request Principal Sir to please welcome Dr. Kavita Gadikar, ma'am. Yeah. Good evening. Before I start, because uh, in the end I may not be there, so I wish all the students, esteemed guests, and all my esteemed colleagues a very happy Holi for tomorrow and today's uh, Holika Dehan Puja also. So at the outset, I am uh, extremely happy to have Dr. Kavita Gadekar Madam with us. Madam, we are highly obliged with your uh, presence and uh, in fact, uh, it is our fortune that you have accepted our invitation and you have spared your valuable time for our students. And uh, I extend a warm welcome to you, Madam, on behalf of our management director, on my personal behalf, on behalf of my teachers and students, everyone to this uh, guest lecture, which will be definitely delivered by you. As Lavina Madam rightly said that it is very important nowadays for the students to be a balanced personality. Yesterday also I was talking to the students and I was just talking to them that we follow a different routine nowadays and particularly during this pandemic time, the routine at every home has changed. Earlier, there used to be some, at least some kind of ground uh, sports or something, uh, physical activity, but now the students have become so dependent on the online uh, modes, whether it is a uh, study, it is game, it is chatting or anything, they are just on the screen. Their routines have changed a lot. There is no time of sleeping, no time of getting up, no physical exercise. Uh, yesterday also I was telling that the food of the house is a good food. People have to eat the food of the house. It's more important to eat. So uh, these are the very important points, although they may not mean that much for us. We feel like what is the difference between the food of the house is the food of the house. We want to eat the food of the house, but no. I think there is a need to understand what is the difference between the food of the house and the food of the house. What is different between getting and uh, getting on right time and following the day routine? What is the time? What is the right time to sleep? लोगों को ऐसा लगता है कि नहीं scientifically तो एक आदमी को छः घंटे सो लिया तो बहुत हो गया क्या फर्क पड़ता है रात में सोए या दिन में सोए? But uh, जो प्रकृति ने कुछ नियम बनाए हैं कुछ uh, rules and regulations होते हैं life में उसको follow करने के क्या फायदे हैं? वो ना follow करने पर क्या नुकसान हो सकते हैं? ये हम सभी जानना चा� and I am sure uh, there cannot be any other person other than Dr. Kavita Gadekar, madam, who is the right person because she herself is a, a renowned doctor. She is secretary of IMA Nasik and director of Dr. Gadekar Maternity Home at Nasik. So I think she's the most befitting person to talk to our students uh, on this topic. And uh, uh, madam, I had uh, sent this particular topic to all my uh, broadcast group also. And uh, one of the very renowned speaker of the uh, University of Mumbai, he also, Chanakya Niti Wale, who is a speaker, 
so he reverted um, uh, the director general of police former director general of police uh, dr d shivanandan he also replied that yes it is a very uh, good topic for the students so i am thankful to you for uh, to you madam for selecting such a nice topic for our students and once again i welcome to you as well as i request all my dear students not to leave this session in between because this is going to be a very important session for you all in your lifetime you will not get such kind of guidance from a doctor so thank you very much uh, for being with us madam and i request uh, you to please guide our students as much as possible thank you thank you very much thank you thank you so much sir for your kind introduction uh, definitely aapne jo bataya hai wo shat pratishat sahi hai और उसी के माध्यम से अभी अब जो अगला लेक्चर होगा मैं इसमें डिलीवर करूंगी ये टॉक में उससे पहले आई वुड रियली थैंक लवीना मैडम फॉर हर काइंड इंट्रोडक्शन टू द टीम एंड टू अवर बी के बिरला नाइट कॉलेज कल्याण विथ ऑल द थ्री सेक्शंस आर्ट साइंस कॉमर्स स्टूडेंट्स आई ऑल्सो Uh, other uh, welcome all the teachers uh, and uh, there are few pointers in my presentation uh, for teachers too so uh, it's beneficial overall for both boys and girls as well as teachers uh, i think my slide is been seen on the screen yes madam yes it is visible okay. so i think without wasting much time it, i have a little lengthy uh, presentation so i'll just start with the presentation so uh, today we have uh, chosen this topic balancing lifestyle for today's youth especially in the post covid times now i am telling post covid but since uh, you all know again china is showing new cases but at least for now uh, we can say after two years of lo lockdown uh, in this post covid scenario overall the health and well being of all the individuals have changed so we need to balance these lifestyle changes which has happened uh, over this period some have become really aware about their health and have st started working on their lifestyle uh, some have gone into the different opposite direction of the health wherein some land up with have landed up with covid we have seen also that especially those not good in their healthy uh, health or your healthy lifestyle they have suffered with covid and the, the one healthy ones have were able to combat the covid illness so for today we are uh, going to uh, talk about adolescents so what is adolescent age group so generally what we is consider is 10 to 19 years is adolescent age and they are again divided into three parts early adolescents middle adolescents and the late one 10 to 13 is early 14 to 16 years is the middle adolescents and 17 to 19 years is the late adolescence and youth is somewhere between 15 to 24 and the common term teens which we use is 15 to 17 uh, so uh, what is the difference in early adolescence and mid, mid adolescence is early adolescence is uh, generally the growing phase that is the spurt of growth which is happening and the beginning of sexual maturation and young people they start to think abstractly while in middle adolescence there are physical changes are already complete and there, then they develop a strong sense of identity and uh, this relates more strongly to the peer group surrounding friends and the thinking pattern becomes more reflective and late adolescence in 16 to 19 years the body is fully developed and this individual ha now has a distinct identity and is more settled has more settled ideas or opinions so why is adolescent health important this adolescent health plays a major role because many of the physical psychological and behavioral changes occur in this duration of life so that is from the 10 to 19 duration there are drastic changes in the physical also changes are there psychological and behavioral changes are there uh, sexual maturity and onset of sexual activity is there there is development of the adult mental the thinking process is changed from a kid to adult thinking process it it gets converted and uh, now they become rest, they are uh, become a responsible individuals as they grow there is healthy responsible parenthood 
the, and uh, this great human resource for society, especially the young uh, generation, is an untappable. It's an untappable energy for the development of nation. And this, uh, there is a growth spurt and physical activity. Uh, girls will start getting menstruation. There is pregnancy seen in these age groups, which are uh, premature, early pregnancies, which are seen during this age group. What are the rationale? The demographic rationale is why it is important because one in five individuals are adolescent. That is 1.2 billion people. The uh, is a adolescent age group. And it is also a matter of public health because uh, it is seen that injuries and violence, early pregnancy, some some specific infection, addictions, these are very common in this age group. And the economic rationale is like socioeconomic deprivation and uh, the bad effects of if they are the people what they undergo is for example in this case they have shown if they uh, if there is poverty the girls may land up with early pregnancy they have they have loss of educational and employment opportunity which eventually leads to poverty and it is a vicious cycle so we have to get these we have to come out of it for the development of that woman for the adolescent and the nation so what is health so health by WHO is defined as a state of complete physical, mental, social, and here it is not mentioned, but also spiritual well-being and not merely absence of disease. So bimari nahi hai, matlab healthy hai nahi, but overall the state, jo sthiti hai, that is called as health. So adolescent development, uh, so what happens is there is a skeletal growth, bone structure growth hota hai. Toh jitna, uh, uh, the, the whatever the growth which has happened 25 percent will take it place during the adolescent time so generally what you have seen ki school may uh, girls ki height around eight and ninth may suddenly they start looking taller and in uh, once you go into college the boys start looking taller so this is that that is a particular age group the there is the growth spurt which is occurring and the maximum growth that is a 25 around 25 percent of the adult height is achieved during this period and apart from that, the body composition changes. So there is a weight gain. The girls in girls, there is an increase in adipose tissue or fat, fat tissue. And in boys, the muscle mass is increases, especially because of the hormone testosterone, which is in which is seen also later on. Uh, sexual growth is seen in the, the form of breast, but development, pubic hair, growth spurt, menses start, and the enlargement of the sex, secondary sexual character underarm, underarm hair. And in boys, there is testicular enlargement, pubic hair is seen, the voice changes, there is voice break, there is weight gain, increased muscle mass, and uh, also the facial bones also, they become masculine. Now we are talking all about physical fitness. Uh, in this age group, the mental health is equally important because there are many, many mental issues which are seen in adolescent age group, which the adolescent people don't come up, come out with. And many of the time it is hidden. So what are uh, mental health issues they can have? These are uh, considered under non-communicable diseases. You know what is communicable, jo hai. COVID is one of the greatest example. Non-communicable, which is doesn't spread, but th those type of diseases are non-communicable. Diabetes, hai, hypertension, hai. mental disease comes under non-communicable disease. So these uh, mental uh, adult mental disorders have their onset during childhood and adolescent, which are many a time covered, and then they present very late. Uh, so the, accordingly at that particular age, it has to be identified. The help if needed should be seek and adequately treated. Uh, in low and middle, middle economic countries, in uh, income countries in, in, in India, adolescents with mental health need often remain outside the safety of healthcare. They don't reach the healthcare system. So uh, generally pediatrician is a primary care uh, physician uh, with uh, who treats the uh, children up to 12 years, but many uh, as uh, old as 18 years also, some of the pediatrician will treat. Psychological growth, there is less interest in parental activities, especially parents start telling jo chalo jate hai, ki shadi ko jate hai. the children are not interested at all uh, because they want to utilize their personal time. There are mood swings, there is intense relationship between the same or opposite sex friends. Suddenly, girls also become good, very good friends. The bonding is uh, very good. 
uh, between boys circle, they, they, the group bonding is very good. So that kind of thinking, peer uh, formation, peer group is uh, formed. There is increased cognition, there is increased need for privacy. Ki mujhe akela chhod do. Uh, lack of impulse control, mujhe ghusa aata hai. So that is lack of impulse control. Increased intellectual ability, that is one thing which is, I said, is the untappable energy of a youth. So which has to be uh, directed in a proper way. And there is also risk-taking behavior. So why I'm telling all you all these is because the purpose of this lecture is to guide you what are the possibilities. You, uh, it will make you aware these are all the things which are happening around. But what is right and what is wrong, you should be able to choose. Uh, generally, it is seen more, many of the adolescents will move from childhood through adolescence into and uh, uh, in, a, in good health. And what are the key problems? So we have just discussed these few of them, like sexual reproductive to early pregnancy. We have seen girls uh, in the early college days, they'll end up in uh, unwanted pregnancy. So these problems are seen. Uh, and the early pregnancy, the girl body is not fully developed. The child is never grows in a proper fashion. Uh, the adequate growth is not achieved. Then they will seek unsafe abortion. They will go to some uh, small clinic in somewhere uh, unknown place. So and uh, that, that is what that is what is see, like the adequate care which is needed for her will not be taken if she lands up with a quack. So rest, uh, some sexually transmitted infections do happen. Uh, it's around 20% uh, infection is seen. So other harmful design some remote areas are seen like female genital mutation. Uh, other injuries like accidents, intentional violence, mental health problems, substance abuse and infective diseases. So is it normal to be attracted to boys or is it normal to be attracted to girls? The way you think about things, these things uh, is affected by all your hormones. Especially there is a change in the hormones. Girls start producing estrogen and progesterone and boys start producing testosterone. So they, uh, there is a general, generally it is seen attraction towards opposite sex. So this is normal, okay? Just remember, most of your friends will also be experiencing in the say, uh, same feelings as they go through these changes. However, few things need to be considered because this is not the time. So what are the issues related to sexuality? How to talk about it? How not to get hurt by diseases? How to make right choices? How to stay healthy? How to avoid pregnancy? This is very important. So also, the apart from reproductive tract infections, uh, some may present, girls may present with infections, acne, boys and girls can have acne in this because sudden change in the hormone will cause increase in the oil secretion in the skin and this oil secretion will the pores get blocked and then pimples develop. So the only thing frequent face washing is essential in this age because I'm talking about acne all of a sudden because they are very, this age group is particularly conscious about their looks, right? So acne, what the best treatment is you can frequently wash your wash your hair, uh, face with your face wash uh, and not burst that pimple because that will lead to spread and scarring. So uh, acne for acne, a simple home remedy is like frequent washing of your face with face, face wash. So it just clears off the excess oil and the blocked pores are also cleaned away. And no need to apply all the fancy uh, things to your skin because your skin otherwise is healthy. Unless you have very severe acne, you can get it treated from a dermatologist. So teenage pregnancy, abortion related issues, we have talked HIV is very, becomes common. If it is if a unsafe, uh, uh, this is uh, unsafe, uh, sex is performed. So they may land up with very severe infection and these infections have a long term implication. They can lead to infertility in both men and women. So every time a precaution has to be taken. So a use of contraception is essential. Safety is always better. So always safety should be considered first. Now coming to nutrition. As this, uh, this age group you have seen, the body is growing and that too at a faster pace. The bones are growing, the muscles are growing. So the body requirement increases. Uh, so nutri but in India, we have seen undernutrition. Uh, this in undernutrition leads to impaired growth, anemia, iodine deficiency, even calcium deficiency. 
iron deficiency anemia is seen in most of the adolescents and uh, this is a ba basically why because the growth requirement is increased and the amount adequate amount is not being provided especially through food and in girls there is menses so menstrual loss of blood is there and thus anemia develops okay and some dieting uh, just to look slim so uh, the adequate nutritious food is not taken this is one and other is khate hai lekin nutritious nahi khate junk food khate so that also leads to anemia so uh, what is anemia is you know I, we have learnt in school iron deficiency hemoglobin i which is form uh, so that becomes deficient and hemoglobin is required for uh, all the things because the blood is circulated in all the systems and that this uh, it helps to keep the system working in a good condition and if you have this less iron so the oxygen requirement in the is not fulfilled and that leads to poor health less growth repeated infection tiredness less lack of concentration or uh, loss of concentration so these are the things which can happen with anemia and uh, you should have a good diet why uh, is a good diet essential because not only you are growing but this is your phase of life where you are attending college and classes and your brain needs extra energy so the better option is always to eat small frequent meals so it provides a constant energy throughout the day uh, eating fresh fruits dry fruits uh, and it's uh, uh, easy and handy oily and junk food is very easy and handy but you have to stay as away from it as possible and plenty of water and because dehydration does occur because you keep running from one class to other doing activities so dehydration happens so uh, plenty of water so say around 3 to 4 liter of water per day has to be uh, uh, consumed and that's because even urinary infections are common if you don't drink adequately or maybe you are using public toilets for uh, during the classes or while traveling so that can you may land up with infection so adequate amount of water is essential and a sound sleep a sound sleep is somewhere like 6 to 8 hours we say but even a power nap in afternoon like 20 minutes power nap will also improve your efficacy so what is a balanced diet you all know we have learned it from school so why should i eat breakfast why it is important it's the one first most important meal of the day and this gives you energy to study and play. So it increases your concentration uh, and a breakfast cereal with high fiber and less fat you should have. Generally, uh, Indian diet is more uh, rich in carbohydrates, so roti and rice. But try to include protein into it because as it is a growing body, the requirement of protein is essential. So how much protein is around 60, 60, 60 gram of protein is required daily per individual so you can take that protein in the form of even vegetarian sources of protein you can have uh, like any uh, of your uh, subeka paratha also you can put add besan ka flour so that will fortify your paratha with the protein content so something even you can add paneer in the paratha so that increases the protein content rather than just having vegetable and roti paratha so you should fortify your food increase enhance the protein quality of your food and uh, then second thing is uh, uh, it is seen each may uh, mid time pe bhook lagti hai to bada pav kha lo chips ka packet le lo so that is something which is absolutely not healthy uh, other options in between what you can have is you can always carry dry fruits dates you can carry chikki you can carry any fruit so that are, these are the healthy options so regular uh, breakfast eater, uh, eaters have proper well well being and this is the pyramid which we have learned. So base is formed by carbohydrates and then vegetables and fruit, dairy products. You have to consume a little lesser quantity and fat rich foods, especially the very less quantity. And this pyramid lies on a base of water. So water is the maximum amount this four liter you have to drink every day because the water helps in metabolism of all these substances which have been eaten. Uh, now malnutrition, undernutrition is one issue and overnutrition is other issue. Obesity is one problem where you eat but you don't get very nutrient. Just eating food is not uh, good health but you need to eat nutritious food. 
and obesity is one of the prevalent problem and it is just on rise it is just not it is just not decreasing rather it is just like just what is said that india is going to become the capital of diabetes so now I, we are seeing also adolescent children and uh, they are getting obese so the this age group really needs to watch on their diet what they are eating a simple formula is if your grandmother and grandfather are 90 plus and in a good health so you just have to look into their plate what they have been eating for so many years and how are they healthy a basic thing will help you cover up rather than giving a big lecture on diet i simply say what just look into their plate what they eat and and the entire day what activity they do so that will help rather than abito if they junk and fancy foods and uh, what they are just adding your weight and the many of them is the empty calories empty calories that is there is no nutrition in, in it so the uh, thing is what you can you should always have a balanced diet which is nutritive rich and that will promote your growth that is a muscle growth skeletal growth not but not the fat group so obesity is in higher in boys and uh, there are some eating disorder also seen in this age group bulimia nervosa anorexia bulimia mein matlab khana khate hai then they vomit out anorexia is to eat very less and they become very skinny Binge eating is beach beach mein khana hai. Sometimes stress eating is also there. So you have to balance between the food and exercise. Be sure to remain within your dietary daily dietary calorie needs. Be physically active for at least 30 minutes uh, most days of the week. So how work? How that this is very specific. 60 minutes a day physical activity may be needed to prevent weight gain. And you want to lose weight. So you have to increase the time 90 to 60 minutes per day and children and teenagers should be physically active for 60 minutes every day or most of the days. So what happens with exercise? This exercise will not only make your body strong and healthy, it will increase the body's immunity. Your digestive system improves. So it took up uh, the problem with constipation also goes off. Concentration increases. You remain fresh. You get sound sleep. Your appetite improves and plus your digestion also improves. And in adulthood, it the long term which illnesses with like hypertension and diabetes or you may say family incidents hai, family mein hai to mujhe bhi aajayega. That you can postpone. See any uh, family illness like diabetes and hypertension can be postponed. So if you have a healthy lifestyle. So that will just that even if your genetic structure is made like that, even your lifestyle, good lifestyle will change your by the means there is something called as epigenetics. So your genetic structure will change karne ki rehti hai epigenetics. So that lifestyle se ho sakti hai if you really follow a disciplined lifestyle. Uh, while you do exercise, there are the, now this age group could boys may rata hai ki muscles banayenge achche se. So this is uh, what is advised is below 18 years, so no gym. After 18 years, you can join gym because your bones are still forming. And if you if the, you join the gym early, there can be epiphyseal tears and uh, fractures and that can lead to shortening of height and your, maybe your height won't grow later. So don't overdo how much is enough, like walking two miles per 30 minutes or running 1.5 miles in the 15 minutes. If you are cycling five miles in 30 minutes or four miles in 15 minutes, if you are like if you like, like dancing, dancing fast for 30 minutes or Zumba for 30 minutes or jumping a rope for 15 minutes, uh, playing basketball or any football game 15 to 20 minutes. And if you are swimming, you, it should be for 30 minutes. So this much at least you have to do for say around five days a week and two days you can take a break. Uh, while doing this also, sometimes you have to keep a watch upon uh, your calcium intake and uh, adequate amount of calcium intake is essential because your bone because are made stronger only till the age of 35. And after 35, your bones don't become stronger. Rather, they start getting that is the bone resorption. Usme se calcium nikalna chalu ho jata hai, brittle bone, calcium and the other elements. So, वो निकलना चालू होता है osteoporosis हो सकता है तो 35 के बाद जो भी bone built हुआ है वो सिर्फ maintain होता है and uh, this is 35 for bone but there are some there are some muscles which you start losing after 30, 25 like your sure, deltoid ये जो deltoid muscle रहता है वो 25 को ही जाने को चालू करते है तो to maintain that muscle you have to exercise 
Exercise will maintain all your muscles and bone and not only maintain, but it also changes your metabolism into a healthy metabolism. The so what happens with this brittle bone is the fracture just thoda sa push kiya gir gaya aur fracture ho gaya so these are brittle bones so bones need to be really strong and women have common high, three times just because of the nutrition most of the time nutrition uh, not uh, taking adequate nutrition lack of exercise so they land up with osteoporosis in early age okay. and then the the preventive is what we have we have been talking is exercise 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 five days a week Uh, is essential along with dietary intake with of calcium so sources of calcium and sources of iron i think everything has been happened in school we we'll focus on important aspects so okay and uh, now we will just uh, see adolescent counseling part so early adolescent they are concrete thinkers they are unable to clearly un understand the cause and if unko pata nahi ki iska kya hoga aage dusparidam so and middle adolescent is more abstractly th typically they are capable of complex logical thinking and late is like longitudinal understanding of how their behavior affect their health generally itna sab uh, if you don't understand simple is uh, this is a age group of exploring and experimenting exploring matlab nayi cheeze try karni hoti hai aur experiment karke karke dekhna hota hai right so this is that age group it's a vulnerable vulnerable age group it has a high energy age group khun uh, garam khun wala bolte hai waise par wo energy if directed in a channelized in a proper way will be really helpful for you in the long term so sex education is also important uh, so helping adolescent to understand their sexuality learn to respect other feelings and to make responsible decision so uh, every opposite sex you have to respect each other as an individual and a sexual relationship in uh, involves respect trust caring of the partner perceiving the needs of partner feeling free to communicate the desires and feeling there is a marshallow triangle the triangle mein what happens is uh, the triangle for girls is the base of the triangle is formed by the uh, what she needs what is her basic need is uh, security she needs security emotional bonding and the apex sabse minimum requirement for that girl is sex and the, the triangle is exactly opposite in case of boys the first thing what is that's the hormonal thing okay so nothing to it so that is the first requirement is the sex and the, the tip of the triangle is this emotional security and other things so that's a very uh, practical and scientific triangle which has been uh, described by masters i couldn't put the slide that is a good slide uh so that is how the uh, it's a behavior pattern which is a natural behavior and it is being seen since seen since ages so an adolescent is surrounded and uh, by his parents brother sisters relatives so all these people have play important role in that development of that adolescent so where you put that adolescent in which uh, type of environment you put the adolescent will develop in that way so adolescent and family life so human relationships are very important adolescent development values moral ethics family is the basic unit of society and the uh, decision making problem solving it help, they help uh, in doing it's like a uh, group decision making and problem solving so talking to your parents uh, to your near ones to your teachers whatever problems you have so related not only to the other issues but the careers also so these all are, these all relationships help you and diet and fitness so family life education educate this growing children regarding various aspects of living in society interacting with other levels uh, so this is for the holistic development overall development of our adolescent and uh, especially these adolescents also have physical sexual cognitive social emotional development so for these are all future family related needs so you, this is important uh, to just focus on this uh, rather than just waver of with the circle ki se behte jana bolte hai usko agar aapko aapki life niyantran mein rakhna hai to ye relationship jo human relationships hai wo apne aaj aaju baaju mein hai family hai friends hai teachers hai school mein 
तो ये सब रिलेशनशिप डेवलप करके आपकी डेवलपमेंट करनी है आपको सो यू हैव टू फोकस ऑन ऑल दिस सो वैल्यूज मॉरल एंड एथिक्स दीज आर ऑल द बेसिक थिंग्स तो बेस्ट फ्रेंड्स इन द वर्ल्ड इज योर पेरेंट सो यू डू नॉट हाइड योर मिस्टेक्स फ्रॉम देम कुछ भी किया रहेगा जस्ट एग्री एंड एक्सेप्ट टू इट मे बी द फर्स्ट टाइम योर पेरेंट मे स्टार्ट शोइंग देयर एंगर but once their anger subsides then maybe they will start really thinking and they will accept it so it's uh, really necessary to tell them rather than hide but sometimes hiding mistakes can just create problem rather than getting it corrected they love you too much only that they can correct your mistakes so you have to trust and love your parents and sometimes your teachers also can be helpful there are some some issues which you you, want, you think you shouldn't tell your parents you, your teachers can come into picture uh this age group also is see that to have increased consumption of tobacco alcohol and there are drug experiment illicit drug risk behaviors are there violence is there so uh, that is what i said garam khoon rehta hai so it is not to be uh, diverted in all these activities which are self harming as well as the society harming activity they have to be channelized in the development of yourself as well as the society something which will help you and the society in a good way has to be the the energy has to be diverted in that that way uh something on abuse which i will talk is uh, there are few touching rules uh, this is for uh, the early adolescent but still it is important for all no one should ever touch your private part except to keep you clean and healthy this is for the small kids Uh, never agree to keep it a secret tell someone you trust now even if it is for secret uh, even it if it is for the kids it is also seen in the adolescent or the elder one and the adolescent group so they are very shy about telling something so it is never to be uh, you should agree to uh, keep any secret ki kisi ko batao mat ya koi blackmail kar raha hai to immediately report it report it something wrong has happened your instincts tell you that something wrong is happening the uh, the person is not behaving in a appropriate way uh, maybe uh, even the behavior forget but inside you start feeling uh, in you feel start feeling in a bad way so that itself is a it should give a indicator that you need to tell it to someone learn self defense now your age uh, you should at least learn few self defense techniques because it's not always about the strength even techniques there are few techniques where you kick on the sensitive areas now this is not only for girls even boys need this because it is not always that girls are abused it is uh, nowadays boys nowadays and before also boys are also abused so self defense techniques uh, many youtube videos you'll see but there are few uh, like you can just kick at the groin area you can just uh, tuck your elbow below the chin okay and sometimes your sensitive area is i just two fingers into the eye also you can confuse the attacker so uh, even if you don't know all the typical judo or karate you can always few tricks and tips you should know uh, to pro to protect yourself and your mind is your best weapon like if you land up in a situation where you feel something fishy or some thing uh, is going to happen or you are all alone on your street uh, on the street so you have to try and seek help or you have to there are phone numbers you can just give a drop a message to parent that i am i am here uh, i am all alone i am traveling i'll try to reach home there are few things uh, which you have to be proactively alert and you have to act quick so and sometimes there is a fight on the road somebody attacks you and then you shout for you first important thing is you shout, shout for help people come around and they will try to protect you once they they who catch hold of the attacker you don't, shouldn't stand there and watch it you should run off because pehle se khud ko bachana zaruri hai kyunki wahan pe khade rahoge aur usse kuch milne wala nahi hai to you have to sometimes those are your, your best decisions वहां पे जाके नहीं अभी इसको मारते हैं ये करते नहीं करना है यू जस्ट शुड शुड मूव योर सेल्फ आउट ऑफ द सिचुएशन एंड कीप योर सेल्फ सेफ फर्स्ट सो व्हाट आर टिप्स लाइक एक्चुअली इट्स नॉट अ प्रॉब्लम दीज आर ऑल नॉर्मल फेज ऑफ द लाइफ यू हैव टू कीप योर सेल्फ कूल काम एंड हेल्दी यू हैव टू शेयर योर फीलिंग्स विद योर फ्रेंड्स टीचर्स एंड पेरेंट्स फर्स्ट इंपॉर्टेंट इज you are here into school and colleges for studies so concentrating on studies is important 
you have to avoid excess use of tv and computers now that all the offline schools have started so uh, things are again going to come back to normal and learn to say no uh, learn to say no if somebody just ask you to do something which you are not willing to do or uh, few things few examples here i'll give uh, so here you have to say a clear no if you go to a party somebody offers you a drink please do not take the drink some cold drink because you don't know what is added in the cold drink if you if you are you are with your friends and they then if the cold drink bottle is opened in front of you and given then you have to take it because and whenever you go to a party you have to inform your parents that your parents should know who all your friends are and uh, if the, your parents should have your friends number and see these are the things these are from the safety perspective because even if your friend circle is there an unknown person can drug you so these uh, safety precautions are essential many a times peer pressure is one thing one uh, one of the boys starts smoking or wo bolta hai dusre ko chal tu bhi le ya drugs ke mamle mein waisa hota hai so you have to say no i do not want to i am not interested and i do not want to. उसको तुम सिखाने से पहले खुद को खुद पहले प्रिवेंट करो कि ये मैं इसमें नहीं मिला जस्ट टू ट्राई आउट यू डोंट वांट यू नो इफ इट इज द एंटायर वर्ल्ड नोज इट इज नॉट गुड देन व्हाई यू वांट टू ट्राई सो सो यू यू हैव टू लर्न टू से नो फर्स्ट सो दिस एज दिस so any change will happen step, change happens one step at a time so suddenly change nahi hoga abhi jitni aadat hai abhi tak aayi hai to sudden change nahi hoga ek ek chote mini steps se you start with so jaise ki lifestyle now uh okay wow okay is there any technical problem Hmm. Am I audible? Yes, madam, you are audible. Ah, uh, the screen is yes, getting, yes, ma'am. Uh, slides are getting shifted on its own. Seems like. Yes, but ma'am, you are audible, but. And the slides Clearly. are visible. they are visible but then uh, they are shifting yeah yeah they are shifting on their own or something is doing no ma'am we have disabled everybody's uh, okay, you know okay. control yeah, so yeah. it is not possible i think okay. something from your end ma'am okay. mm -hmm, mm -hmm. fine so we will just uh, move towards obesity uh, obesity is a rising problem we are have different grades of obesity as per the bmi uh, so childhood obesity is an increasing problem these lead to uh, later in life into the heart disease and other problems i'll just uh, restart the slide show again so uh, body fat content is the ad uh, adiposity now few things important about obesity is the body fat is all over the body but which is a bad fat the fat around your tummy is a bad fat that uh, so it's uh, sometimes uh, two boys for example both weigh 60 kg uh, but the one is muscular and uh, with a, a flat tummy and one is obese with a rounded tummy both have equal weight equal height and equal age the fat the person who has a tummy fat will have more problems because the tummy fat the is are known to cause illnesses like metabolic diseases or insulin related diseases so especially putting on fat on the tummy is not good so uh, for that again exercise and diet is the primary thing but if the weight is more if they are morbidly obese 
तो समटाइम्स दे रियली नीड थेरेपी मेडिकल थेरेपी और सम वेरी वेरी मॉर्बिडली ओबेस दे नीड सर्जरी डायट्री वॉट वी हैव ऑलरेडी स्पोक लो डोंट ईट जंक फूड यू हैव अ नॉर्मल प्रोटीन डायट हाई फाइबर डायट अवॉइड जंक फूड इन फूड ऑल्सो uh it's better to eat fact, uh, farm produce rather than going for factory produce so whatever comes in your plate has to be cooked prepared at home rather than a packed food so that is how you should change your eating habits if not now you can implement these things so uh, uh, that way even the food habits like uh, including fiber rich you eating all type of grains that uh, should be uh, included in your diet not just a one simple wheat or rice there are other millets bajri jowar that has to be included this diet generally we never prescribe for children but now with the rising incidence they also need to follow what adults uh, follow for their weight loss uh, apart from that cold drinks and they have plenty of sugar and plenty of calories these are all empty calories empty calories that is they will just provide energy and fat but they won't provide any nutrition and prevention it it start in the early childhood and because at least in childhood why it is important because weight loss is equally easier in the adolescent or childhood age because your body metabolic rate by naturally is good because you can do activities run around fata fat tum kaam kar sakte ho it's natural so uh, if you put on weight also you are easy to lose on weight but as you grow into adult losing weight becomes a little difficult because apart from only food related obesity other hormonal problems start in to develop now what better example than akshay kumar he is i think 50 plus and he just is uh, it's he what is his fitness mantra is not having bulky body with bicep or abs it is more important to eat right and exercise regularly at this age also he gets up early as early as 4 am and sleeps at 10 am avoids parties he try eats as uh, as much as home food so that is the discipline at that particular age and that uh, he is living that healthy so there are inspiration around you a good inspiration you can always take uh, lessons from Uh, now in this lockdown many people are stuck to online education wo hone ke baad fir mobile pe to continue digital eye strain aa raha hai that blue light also affects your eye vision and continuous uh, stare, staring at the screen your uh, pupils are co continuously under strain so uh, you try and avoid as much as digital platform and i mean the uh, way of learning physical form of learning is important offline now if you good thing about offline is uh, you must have noticed in two years what was your personality or social development nothing but it was of course the, the digital platform was useful in covid times but it uh, the your work was done your education was continuously on but it, your development didn't occur jo social development friends ke sath hote hai जो तुम्हारा सर्कल होता है योर चिटचेट्स हैपन दीज स्मॉल स्मॉल थिंग्स आर पार्ट ऑफ योर डेवलपमेंट ऑफ योर पर्सनैलिटी तो गपछप भी होते हैं दीज आर ऑल पार्ट इंटरपर्सनल भी फीलिंग गुड होता है फील गुड फैक्टर डेवलप होता है देर आर फ्यूरोमोन्स विच आर सिक्रेटेड तो सबकॉन्शियसली यू डोंट नो बट देर आर फ्यू चेंजेस हैपनिंग वेन यू इंटरेक्ट विथ पीपल अराउंड यू सो दैट इज हेल्पफुल Uh, that never happened with the digital but now that was a essential thing uh, during the lockdown that was helpful but now that lockdown is not there you have to try and avoid to all the screen uh, vision uh, screen straining okay, these all lead to uh, visual acuity problems and uh, uh, so many symptoms you can get the lazy eye also especially in a younger age if you keep watching more of a screen uh, then there is reduced visual ability blurred vision you can land up with specs and even the poor sitting posture so you should always if at all you are using the screen you have, should have correct posture as per the ergonomics so that's it i think most of it is covered there are many more things but i think uh, if we have questions we can take those and the meanwhile i can answer through questions also the 
uh, any uh, topic especially you want me to discuss. Yes, I would like uh, to invite questions. Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you so much for such an informative session. And uh, now I would like students uh, who have questions or any kind of queries. So please, students, feel free to ask. Students, mic is enabled for you all. If uh, any queries, you are to ask. Or else you can also put in the conversation, chat and conversation part. Yes, students. I can. If you feel to ask it, yes, yes. yes. Yeah. Did you understand the lecture basically? <laughs> Why we wanted to ask? Did you understand the lecture? Yeah, definitely, madam. Yes, go ahead. Madam, I have a question. Uh -huh. um, yeah. I just want to ask, or I just want you to tell the student the importance of getting early in the morning. What is yes, yes. what is the difference if it, they get at uh, 10 o'clock and uh, what happens when they get it on right time? Yes. Uh, getting up early in the morning uh, mm -hmm. are definitely beneficial from scientific point of view. The air is pure. pure. Uh, early morning you get up, your bowel movements happen, uh, you drink la, ma, water in the morning, you, you get quick bowel movements rather than if you get late, your bowel movements don't happen. Bowel movement means uh, passing of uh, nature's call, what you say. So uh, that is important because all health problem again are, comes back to this. So to remain healthy and you have uh, Brahma Murta bhi bolte hai usko. Uh, even in yoga, they are advised to get up early in the morning. Uh, so uh, it, it is not only uh, helpful in maintaining your health, but also it will give you ample of time in morning for your exercise to do, do your some concentration activities like dhyan or meditation. So if uh, as adolescent uh, children, children should... Yeah. As an adolescent, you all children should start doing this. This not only improves your concentration in studies, but overall peace and calmness of mind, it is essential. So getting up early is always, always a good habit and getting early to bed is also good. Rather, and important what I would say is at night uh, while going to bed also, you shouldn't keep watching your mobile because that blue light affects again, again your pineal glands and then you may not get sleep early. So you have to avoid the screen as much as the blue light, especially. So as much as possible in the evenings, even uh, caffeinated drinks like coffee and all uh, in the evening after uh, before 5 p.m. you can have, but after 5 p.m. you will hamper your sleep. So uh, a good night sleep is essential, but equally getting up early, early doing all uh, meditation, exercise, yoga, uh, or once. It's 5 p.m. You can 5 a.m. You can just go out for a jog in a fresh air for your good health. I hope I have. Thank you so much, ma'am. 
Yes. Uh, you even can chat box, yeah. Uh, somebody, if you yes. are not comfortable, you can answer. Put questions in chat box is also okay. Yes, student. That ma'am has rightly said. If you not feel like feeling like you know putting your questions on this uh, you know platform, you can put it in the chat box. We can convey it to ma'am. Ma'am, I have a question. Eva, yeah, 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 yeah. Please go ahead. Uh, me being a mother of two uh, children, out of which one is an adolescent, she is in ninth now. Uh, generally, it has been observed a change in the behavior, as mm -hmm. in. Now even the smallest of things hurt her. Yeah. Like uh, she is, uh, she feels that she is the victim. Mm, they get like victimized. They feel that ki aare mm -hmm. sab mujhe hi bolte and all that. Though she is good at many things, but the moment you point anything, she that takes it very personally. That is what uh, we have seen yeah. early adolescent days. The self-centric nature. Uh, anything and everything around the world happen and they start blaming themselves. So it's not uh, so the only way is like uh, you start becoming her friend and you can always show her the path. Uh, you shouldn't feel guilty or you shouldn't victimize yourself. So that is how you can counsel yourself as a mother who is mother is always the best counselor. Uh, so always be friendly with her and sometimes uh, if she's open about her thoughts is good but if she is not then you should just uh, take her into uh, the confidence and just uh, can inquire a few things if required uh, you can in her case if you feel you can always take a she, uh, professional help also counselor always helps to bridge in the gaps so that that also will be essential if needed but first thing, a mother is the best counselor. As I have said, you can always talk to her and you can always explain. Many times they don't know what to do. They, the, the, they, the feelings and the hormonal changes, they are just so abrupt. They don't know what is going on. Why are you only shouting at me only? the what we said, abstract thinking. So just we have to just take them into confidence, be their friends. Uh, and if, once they have confidence on us, then they start opening up. Thank you so much, ma'am. I'll uh, try to implement what you have said. Uh, in the chat box, I can few, I can see a few questions. There's a question, uh, as in how much of intake of junk food is okay? One student has asked. <laughs> I would say zero, but oh. once, once in a week, a little amount is okay. Uh, once in a week, a small amount is okay. One time, not the entire day. But you one. But what I would suggest, if you when you have healthy options, uh, why not go for healthy options? Junk food is like easy, na easy. Uh, okay, say, uh, jaisa computer ghar pe hai or class kar sakte hai. To school or uska importance kam ho jata hai. Lekin school colleges apne development mein itna important role play karte hai that you realize once you are there. Waise junk food itna easy or handy hai. So, जो भी शाइन करता है जो टेस्टी रहता है जो इजीली निगल सकते हैं दोस फूड आर नॉट गुड रिफाइंड फूड स्पेशली रिफाइंड मतलब जो तुमने प्रोसेस कर कर करके उसको छोटा सा एकदम माइक्रो बना दिया है तो अगर गेहूं को रिफाइंड कर कर के बनाते तो लास्ट एंड प्रोडक्ट क्या होता है मैदा ऑयल को रिफाइंड कर कर के करते रिफाइंड रिफाइंड ऑयल सो दीज ऑल रिफाइंड और बारीक जितना किया है इज नॉट गुड जितना रॉ फॉर्म में खाते हो Jitna less refined khate ho, jitna homemade khate ho, that is all healthy options. So uh, now these chips and all, all are made up of refined products only. So uh, chips are even handy, but uh, these are not healthy options. But agar apko lag raha hai, see, even your diet, you know, ki abhi lag raha hai ki kare class extend ho raha hai, uh, chaldi se kuch to canteen mein se kuch to junk uthate hai, kha lete hai. But why don't you plan your diet also? Just a study plan, karte ho, pura din ka routine plan. Karte ho. Uh, aap tiffin ke saath saath additional uh, uh, jo small, small foods, energy foods, energy packet food, bolte hai, jase dates, hai, almonds, hai, dry fruits, hai, uh, laddu bana sakte ho, uh, seeds. Ka. Other than that, you can always have fruit. हम बाहर जंक फूड जैसा मिलता वैसा फ्रूट वाला भी खड़ा होता है वहां से उसे फ्रूट ले लो ना फ्रूट लेके खा लो तो ऐसे ऑप्शन ढूंढो ना व्हाई व्हाई डोंट यू स्टार्ट चेंज फ्रॉम योरसेल्फ पूरा अगर दुनिया भी जंक फूड खा रहा है तुम स्टार्ट करो ना अपने लेवल से चेंज क्योंकि हेल्दी चेंज के लिए 
करेंगे तो आपको क्यों मोटिवेशन चाहिए हेल्दी तो सालों से सदियों से चल रहा है तो यू वाई यू मोटिवेट यूर सेल्फ आई एम गोइंग टू ईट हेल्दी ऑप्शन होंगे मत खाओ नहीं तो फास्टिंग इज ऑल्सो गुड जंक फूड खाना ही चाहिए ऐसे कुछ नहीं फास्टिंग इज ऑल्सो गुड फास्टिंग से भी हेल्थ इंप्रूव होती है फर्स्ट once you are healthy and, and in a sound mind the things will fall into place uh, rather than running or after the problem you start treating uh, your health as a priority uh, give time for yourself give time for your physical and mental health uh, physical health you can always go for a walk or exercise if not started and uh, mental health you can always do meditation concentration techniques anything even uh, agar aap dev puja karte ho aadha ghanta concentration se karo wo bhi chalta hai तो आप अपने लिए टाइम दो वंस यू आर हैप्पी नो सराउंडिंग्स विल गेट हैप्पी व्हाट हैपेंस वंस यू आर इरिटेबल प्लेस इट ऑन योर चिल्ड्रन द चिल्ड्रन को चिल्ड्रन को खुद को आज कौन चिल्लाया तो अच्छा लगता है मुझे भी नहीं अच्छा लगेगा कोई चिल्लाएगा तो पर मुझे अगर कोई शांति से बोलेगा तो मैं सुनूंगी ना एटलीस्ट आई विल गिव अ थॉट कि व्हाट हैपन इरिटेबल है इतना यू कांट एक्सपेक्ट चिल्ड्रन टू बी मैच्योर टू अंडरस्टैंड कि व्हाई मदर इज इरिटेबल दे विल अंडरस्टैंड वंस दे ग्रो अप but if they are small na they will they in fact we have to be as patient and quiet with the children and happy once you are happy no the children will also be automatically they and you need not control also then basically aap kisi ko control bhi nahi karna chahiye control is a wrong word so you have to be a guide you should be a support you know those are the terms to so, kisi ko control karna is like wo bolte hai na mitti ko tight pakdoge to fisal jayega तो तो ऐसे पकड़ोगे तो ऐसे पकड़ोगे तो ज्यादा मिट्टी रहेगा राइट सो दैट वे यू हैव टू स्टार्ट थिंकिंग दैट इज वाई एंड टू ब्रिंग दैट थिंकिंग ऑल्सो यू हैव टू वर्क ऑन योर सेल्फ फर्स्ट एंड देन किड्स विल ऑटोम किड्स अपना अपना डेवलप होता है सराउंडिंग में अच्छा सराउंडिंग तो अच्छे से वो डेवलप होते जो प्रोवाइड गुड सराउंडिंग दे विल ग्रो ऑन दियर ओन थैंक यू मैम आई हैव वन मोर क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम कोमल Uh, she is asking ma'am could you please tell some effective ways to take care of my eyes uh first is as uh, reduce uh, the digital uh, screen as much as possible uh, then uh, you can practice long distance focusing and near distance focusing apart from screen matlab ko dur ke ek object pe concentrate karo fir pass ke object ko concentrate karo आई मूवमेंट रहते हैं स्पेसिफिक आई मूवमेंट आई एक्सरसाइजेज विच यू कैन डू इट एवरी डे एंड न्यूट्रिशन में विटामिन ए रिच फूड्स यू कैन हैव टू हैव अ गुड यू नो द विटामिन इज ए इज वन ऑफ द एसेंशियल विटामि नीडेड फॉर आई एंड ओनली आई इज जस्ट डोंट फोकस बट ओवरऑल हेल्प भी इम्प्रूव करो सो दैट विल ऑल्सो हेल्प यू इम्प्रूव थैंक यू मैम आई हैव वन मोर लास्ट क्वेश्चन from prem uh, and he has uh, to suggest some uh, pointers to increase or boost confidence he says he faces low confidence and you know how can he boost See, his confidence uh, to build your confidence you have to work hard uh, confidence is not ki aaj so ke utha to i am a confident person you have to really work hard you shouldn't give up on things किसी भी आप पढ़ाई में हो या कुछ एंड यू हैव टू गिव ट्राई यू शुड ऑलवेज ट्राई कि समझो फॉर स्टेज कभी नहीं किया है तो स्टेज पे जाके बोलना सीखो प्रिपेयर योर सेल्फ हंड्रेड टाइम्स की उस पर एरर ही नहीं आएगा सो हार्ड वर्क इज द की टू फॉर ऑल दिस थिंग वंस यू हार्ड वर्क विल एंड हार्ड वर्क के बाद इतना हार्ड वर्क के बाद वो रिजल्ट आता ही है वो कहीं नहीं जाता है आप, आप जो डिलीवर करना चाहते हो वो अपने आप आ ही जाता है एंड इट बिकम्स एरर फ्री flawless whatever maybe it is a performance maybe it is your studies so hard work is the key for it how to overwhelming on ends anorexia how to overcome yes, on anorexia overcome as on anorexia yes that is what huh. so anorexia basically see uh, if it is only related to diet your diet should improve 
but if in case uh, you are way thin, you get fever and all, you just need consulting is one thing, getting consultation with a doctor. Second, if it is nutritional and you are, you say you are eating, but I'm not putting on weight, then you have to start exercising. Uh, exercise will not uh, only, it is not to reduce weight only. Exercise is also to build body. So, to exertion, jo hai karna, exertion, matlab college mein aana jana is exertion. But exercise jab karoge, a ek hanta, to aap thakoge, aapka appetite badega, to aapko bhook lagegi. Or jit appetite badne ke saath saath aapka digestion improve hoga, to absorption ho ke aapke body mein wo deposit, nutritive jo bhi hai, sab nutrition wo deposit hoga. And your body, you will, uh, jo lean thin body hai, you will become a healthy one. So generally, uh, exercise will help you to guide all these things. So jo low on diet hair, not putting on weight, basically that. And sometimes you don't feel like eating, but start exercising, you will start feel like eating. So many times, uh, this is only for the nutritional aspect, which I'm talking. But if there is some illness and all she need, uh, it has to be uh, looked for. And uh, clinical examination would be essentially that's, that's her or his case. Ma'am, I always get up early and study, but I feel so sleepy that everything turned out to be unproductive. Can you suggest me some ways to avoid it? Okay, I'll tell you what I used to do. College me. Uh, I I was I used to go early to bed because Rat ko mere se padai nahi hoti thi, and I used to get up early three baje utha do. So that was a like a double benefit. So three से five बजे पढ़ने का फिर पांच से पांच बजे फिर सो जाने का क्योंकि सुबह को एक बार नींद होती है. तो cheating था. पर फिर सुबह की भी नींद मिलती है और रात की भी नींद मिलती है. और बीच में सुबह में पढ़ाई भी हो जाती थी. So that was my way. So you can work your way. But uh, but study के लिए uh, see whichever like some some people can study overnight. Some people can get up early and study. तो मुझे morning का पढ़ाई का याद रहता था. Few of my friends, they used to study overnight, pure raat ko. But see, there are few who won't sleep also. So, waise mat karo, sleep adequate. Minimum five, five hours sleep karo. But exam ke time pe, then suddenly you start to hurry up, no, toh, that won't help. The best formula is every day consistently studying. So, suddenly you don't overburden yourself. And every day consistently you take five to six hours sleep if there is a lot of studies. Uh, so, uh, so uh, during exams, in fact, it, it would, should be reverse. Exam ke time pe zyada suna chahiye. Seven, eight hours. Kyunki tumhari preparation pehle ho chukhi hai. Not that exam ke time pe, now I am going to mug up all the things. So all the days you study, and exam ke time pe you should be chill, chill. You know? So that will be like, so you, matlab itna padai ho gaya hai, itne every day thoda thoda bites mein itna kiya hai ki ekdam burden nahi aega, stress nahi aega. And exam bhi aaram se. Kyunki exam mein bhi stress free rehna hota hai, right? So phir exam ke time pe, you cannot put, Cover up the entire portion all of a sudden and one day may you, do, you don't expect to remember everything. So, thoda, 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 the day which you has been taught, school mein hum log homework karte te, college mein jake hum log bhool jate. To wo hona chahi, even classes mein cover up ho jata hai kaafi hatta. So, you start focusing on that wo, wo aspect pe, consistency rather than suddenly pe getting up. And fix your time, rat ka padai jamta hai, morning ka padai jamta hai. Kyunki pura din to school, college, uh, classes mein chale jate hai. To ek Slot nikal. Now see, abhi college mein 11, 12 tak, uh, what I remember, the time which we used to get was after dinner and early morning. But in medical field, once I went, the time we milta tha. So, hum log ko job sikha de ta, tabhi padna padna. So, aisa, tum apna time plan karo ki jaha pe tum padhai ke liye wo time rakho ke, par rest bhi to ke, aur, uh, other things see are unproductive is like either you your nutrition ma'am you are muted So you can just take a walk for 15 minutes and come back and study. So you may find the change. Ki, aray, pehle to nahi tha. Aap mera mind fresh hai, fresh mind se 
अलग तरीके से पढ़ सकती हूँ या पढ़ सकता हूँ या जस्ट टेक टू मिनट्स ब्रेक या फ्रेंड से बात कर लो फिर थोड़ा सा अलग मूड चेंज होता है देन यू यू कैन कॉन्सेंट्रेट पर यू कैन दोज आर लाइक बिल्कुल भी आपको मन नहीं कर रहा है या आपको लग रहा है कि कुछ दिमाग में नहीं जा रहा है तो यू जस्ट टेक अ चेंज टेक अ ब्रेक एंड कम बैक टू अगेन द सेम थिंग विच यू आर डूइंग फर्स्ट तो फर्स्ट और लास्ट जो साफ का ब्रेक जो है उसमें फर्क रहता है इवन द पावर नैप विच आई टोल्ड यू दैट इज ऑल्सो हेल्पफुल एक पंद्रह बीस मिनट भी आप एकदम शांत भी सो सकते हैं एंड यू गेट अप अलार्म लगा के उठो तो यू विल फील फ्रेश एंड एनर्जेटिक तो कोपअप या कॉन्सेंट्रेशन ग्रास्पिंग पावर इंक्रीज करने को भी हेल्प होगा I can see any more questions. Thank you so much. Okay, I have a question. Hello, am I audible? Yes. Yes. Uh, yeah, ma'am, I had a question about balance diet. Uh, with the kind of and quality of food that we get in the market today, how important uh, important is it to have nutritional supplements along with food, ma'am? Yeah, at a, after a particular age group, we do say the, you start taking supplement. generally in young age it is not needed because absorption is good activity level is good bmr is good but after was particular age like 35 40 we to suggest you can always take nutritional supplement but if possible if uh, you can uh, provide those nutrition through food it's always better par nahi ho raha hai ya working pattern is such to a multi vitamin supplement is always better and some like when in ladies after 40 we tell them to take calcium supplement also क्योंकि कैसा है वन ग्राम कैल्शियम के लिए एक लीटर दूध पीना पड़ेगा उसको पिएंगे तो क्या हालत होगा तो उससे अच्छे एक वन ग्राम कैल्शियम टैबलेट ले लो सो इट इज हेल्पफुल प्लस ओनली कैल्शियम खा के योर बोन्स वन बिकम स्ट्रॉन्ग अनलेस यू मेक डू एक्टिविटी कैल्शियम विल बी यूटिलाइज्ड बाय द बॉडी बिकॉज़ एनीथिंग ओनली पुटिंग इट इन आवर माउथ एंड टू द टमी विल नॉट हेल्प यू हैव टू डू सम एक्टिविटी सो दैट ते अंग मराठी म्हणतो ना अंगी लागले पाहिजे त्याच्यासाठी काहीतरी कसरत केली पाहिजे की नेमक त्या अंगी लागतो वैसा आहे तो ओके थँक यू मॅम थँक यू सो मच मॅम फॉर पेशंटली आन्सरिंग each and every question thank you so much uh, any more questions students or anybody present here wishes to ask any more questions okay in that case i would like to request my colleague varsha parbat ma'am to propose a vote of thanks thank you lavina ma'am a very good evening to one and all present here Uh, it gives me an immense pleasure to deliver the vote of thanks for this wonderful session to all the dignitaries assembled here i would like to thank our today's guest dr kavita gadika ma'am who spare time from her busy schedule to grace this session thank you so much ma'am for enlightening our students with your inspiring and motivating words and management skills for healthy life as it always needed to balance our lifestyle i extend my gratitude to our principal dr harish dubey sir for his support and guidance for organizing such events thank you sir for uh, assisting and encouraging all of us i would also like to thank all my colleagues for their support for for making this session successful and last but not the least thank you my dear students for your presence thank you everyone